If I were a boy Even just for a day I'd roll out of bed in the morning And throw on what I wanted and go Drink beer with the guys And then chase after girls Kick it with who I wanted And I never get confronted for it Cause they stick up for me If I were a bird I think I could understand What about one people then? Uh, so, we must know what time it is when I'm sat in this chair, yeah? It's recording time. <laughs> it's recording time, baby. So this is actually, it's actually a song I've reacted to already, but it was a live version that I reacted to. Uh, and it was Angelina Jordan with, uh, is it Tony Gad? Toby Gad, not Tony Gad. I really liked the version that she did. I think um, it's always down to personal opinion, isn't it? And like personal preference and stuff. Like for me, um, obviously Beyonce didn't write the song, but, but she made that song quite famous, obviously, when she did it. And that's, that's the version that is close to my heart. Um, but what I like about this version is that it's, uh, it's just sung completely differently. Do you know what I mean? Like her, Angelina uh, Jordan's style uh, is completely different to Beyonce's. And I know that some people will be on my comments they'll be like, it's the best version ever, Beyonce who. And that's cool, do you know what I mean? Like, that's your opinion, that's fine. It may not be my opinion, <laughs> um, but I still really, really enjoy it. So I really want to have a look at what the music video was saying. And there's another live performance as well, which I probably will do in the same reaction to be fair. Probably do this one and the live version as well. Um, so yeah, let's, let's dive straight on in and let's see what it's saying. And again, it's still so weird to see Angelina Jordan like with, you know, just, just grown up face, like bearing in mind that, you know, when I came across her, she was like a seven year old little girl. Like, it's just like, this is, it's just crazy. It's just crazy, but the, but the good kind of crazy. If I were a boy, even just for a day, bed in the morning and throw on what I wanted and go drink beer with the guys and chase after girls I kick it with who I wanted and I never get confronted for it cause they stick up for me if I were a boy Turn off my phone Tell everyone it's broken So they think that I was sleeping in the She's so stunning, isn't she? She's so stunning I put myself first And make the rules as I go
So that was filmed and produced by Toby Gad. Okay, so I think I like that. I like the I like the simplicity of the of the video. I think on that, like it's quite. I'm guessing that the the concept. What I'm taking from it is, you know, a girl who's probably had a, a fight with with her partner or whatever, and is just like, I'm just so done with this. Like I'm just so, and then just like literally throws on a hoodie and is just having these thoughts just rattling around her head. Do you know what I mean? Just going about her everyday life, thinking how easy would it be if I was just you, yeah? And and I, and I did all the things that she's talking about. And I like the fact that as she's walking through, like all these people in the background are just kind of like stopping and staring to be like. So I can imagine, obviously, she's walking while someone's filming her. So people must be like, "Is it? Are, are we gonna be in a movie, <laughs> Angelina Jolie? Is that you?" Um, so no, I think that's really cool. Um, and again, I love, I love it, like some street art and graffiti and and that kind of stuff. That's quite cool. All the colours are really popping. Um, so it, in that sense, it's cool. I I probably would have liked a bit more. Like I think, but I think in terms of just a. As a, a, a very simple concept, I think is you know because again most of the time when people are having these kind of thoughts, um, it is as you're going about your everyday life. Do you know what I mean? You're not having some big monumental music video moment whilst you're thinking about you know when you're contemplating life. Do you know what I mean? You are just literally getting up, going to work, sat on the bus, like walking to and from you know commuting or whatever. And nine times out of ten, probably in regular old clothes as well. Old clothes, yeah, I mean, just regular clothes. So I kind of like that simplicity, I suppose, actually. Um, but it would have been nice to have seen, like, some other elements of her day. That, if that's the case, and she was, you know, just contemplating what she's thinking about throughout her day, it would have been cool to kind of see that. Um, I like the, the, the actual vocal on this, or the recording on this anyway. Um, I like the. I, I think I might even prefer this to what I saw last time because um, the the runs that I heard in terms of the um, well the runs that she did I thought were really really nice and um, and the belts were really big and like as as big as they were they came down really well as well um, and the vocal fry which again she's like sick at doing as well so I think for me I kind of just really enjoyed both the audio and the visual elements of this. Um, and like I said at the beginning, everyone's got a personal taste, do you know what I mean? Everyone's got a personal taste. So for me, like, this is definitely a softer, um, like a softer vocal, like, which is still quite nice because that means it's quite tender at the same point. And again, it's quite nice to have that, um, that difference. You know, we live in a world where there's, you know, different, very, we live in a world where there's different variations of, you know, the same song and stuff. And actually, it's really nice to have that. Um, and it's nice that people can go to their go to. Uh, depending on what they're leaning in, so that's really cool. Um, so I'm going to watch this um, So Far performance that came out five days ago. Uh, so let's see what this one's saying. Might as well do it on the same one, the same song, so. Let's have a look. In London. Five days ago in London. Boy, mm. even just for a day, I'd fall out of bed in the morning and throw on what I wanted, then go mm. drink beer with the guys and then chase after girls. Mm. Kick it with who I wanted And I never get confronted for it Cause they stick up for me If I were a bird I think I could understand 
how it feels to love a girl I swear I'll be a better man I listen to her Cause I know I'm her When you lose the one you wanted Cause he's taking you for granted And everything you had got destroyed If I were a boy I would turn on my phone And tell everyone it's broken So they think that I was sleeping alone I put myself first And make the rules as I go Cause I know that she'd be faithful Waiting for me to come home To come home Don't understand Oh yeah I would feel so love a girl Someday you wish you were A better man Yeah You don't listen to her You don't care about her Until you lose the one you want Cause you taking her for granted yeah. Everything you have got destroyed But you're just a boy Thank you so much Do you know what? It's so enchanting listening to us sing that live And I think what's nice about it and and again i guess the, the reason that i keep making the point about beyonce is that if you know me <laughs> and if you know my channel well you'll know what an entrenched fan i am like i'm such a big fan um and i guess i'm trying to in the best way i can give uh, angelina her flowers because to me like i i i'm i'm more than happy more than content with the with the version that Beyonce put out there. Um, but I feel what this does, it provides like, it just, it just a different texture and a different kind of like color to the song and its approach. Do you know what I mean? Because of the way that um, Angelina sings and the kind of texture of her voice, and again, that vocal fry that's so present, even from like the first, I, I mean, I can't do it, boy. Like, I can't do it, I can't, I, can't, I wish I could, I could do it, believe me, I get a record deal. <laughs> but like, you know, she, she, she's she, got that, that, that vocal texture from the beginning, um, which means then that kind of where, what she does with the song, it's not, the, it's not, it's not the same or necessary as what Beyonce does with the song. Do, do, do you know what I'm saying? Like, so for me, I'm just glad that we have both because, like, and, and probably many other versions that I've not even heard yet, but like, I'm just glad that there is another version and with Toby Gad on it as well, because there's something magical about him playing the keys while she's singing in the way that she sings that song. And um, that adds a certain magic to it. Like I said, for me personally, like I've got my personal leanings, what I personally prefer. Um, but we live in a world where I haven't got to choose between the two of them. I can just enjoy them both. Um, but yeah, it's nice to, uh, if you've been on my channel for a while, you'll know that I, 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 I always make some kind of comparison because I kind of feel like I'm, I'm unable not to. I don't feel as though I can hear a song that I've heard before 
and not go, ooh, if it's good, or, oh, I don't know, do you know what I mean? So it's, it's just a natural uh, thing for me. I don't know if anyone else is the same. Maybe maybe you're not, and maybe you can just, you know, have something completely isolated and not think about the other ones. But for me, I, natu I naturally will go to where I heard this last and where I last enjoyed it. And like I said, for me, I, I love the, the music video. I'm really enjoying it. Like that was, that performance felt so tender. Do you know what I mean? And again, because it's quite an intimate venue as well. It just felt really... Yeah, I really, I really liked the vocal choices you made on that. Yeah, I liked it. I really liked it. I really, really liked it. And, and in fact, actually, I actually think I prefer this version, the so far version, than to the one I did before. Um, but yeah, I'd love to know what you guys' thoughts are. Like, I imagine that if you're an Angelina fan, you'll absolutely you'll love this. Um, how, did, how did the live performances like compare to this one? And the last one, um, what did you think of the music video? Um, yeah, like I'd love to know what your thoughts are. So if you did enjoy this, then please do drop me a like and subscribe. That'd be amazing. Thank you very much. Uh, and again, uh, drop your comments in the in the comments below. And if you want to uh, help support the channel any further, if you want to go on a little bit further, uh, then comment over to Patreon. I'm I'm here. I'm waiting. Like I welcome you with open arms. <laughs> but for now, thank you so much for watching, and I hope to see you on the next one. <laughs>